Boys. Nick Rubinovitz has just turned 40 years old and is on the verge of a midlife crisis, except that apparently 40 is the new 30. So now he's not sure whether he's in a crisis, which is a crisis in itself. Nick, good morning. What is good going morning. on? Are you in a crisis? Are you not in a crisis? No, no, I didn't have time. You didn't have time? No, because my wife gave birth as well for the third time. Are you serious? Congratulations. So was, thank you so much. Wow, girl boy. So it's her time to shine in terms of um, a crisis. Yeah. And I, it's my job just to make sure she's... To manage it. Yeah, I just walk past. Sometimes it's just... <laughs> I just drop a Zoloft in her coffee when she's oh not looking. Gosh. And I tell her she looks thin. Yeah. And that's my job. That's winning at life. That's winning at life. Okay, well, let's talk about this show. I yeah. mean, is this a snippet, what we've just talked about, of what we can expect yeah, in there's, Fortified? There's definitely stuff about 40 and midlife crises and kids and, yeah. uh, and also the, the Gospel Award for Jews. Because oh, wow. we never get a chance never. to shine at that. Never, never. Never. The last time I sang in a Jewish competition was my bar mitzvah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Do you want to hear a portion of that? Um, I don't know. Do you want to give yeah. us a little? Uh, I remember the first two words. Sure. Because <laughs> I was 13. My voice was breaking. Okay. Maybe that's why. That's the isn't... story of Noah, by the way. <laughs> really? Yeah. It means getting the elephants in was a nightmare. I think maybe that's why there isn't a competition because... They feel like that's what they'll expect. It could very well be the reason. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell us what your audience members can expect from your show. Yeah, they, they should expect to laugh, and if they don't, then they will be upset because unfulfilled expectations yeah. lead to upset. So okay. um, that's a life hack for this festive season when you have <laughs> an event with your family. Keep those expectations low. Yeah. Lower? No, lower. There we or go. Or have none at all. Do you none know what? at all, exactly. I think men are really going to appreciate this because I think you're going to maybe share certain truths that they're afraid to say out loud. Everybody's thinking it, but they're not. They're afraid to say it. Yes, here's a good one as a man. When you go for a business trip, right? Yeah. Don't pretend to be having a bad time. Okay. Because I do that sometimes <laughs> with my wife. She's like, how's Joburg? And I go... It's awful. They arrested me for chewing gum on the car train. The pillows were hard, like that. And yeah. then she goes, did someone wake you up at 4 o'clock in the morning? And then I go, no. Nah. And then she goes, well, then shut up. Oh. <laughs> I, right. always, I always use the line, did you give birth to a baby yet in your life? No, then you've got nothing to complain about, honey. No. Yeah, definitely. Um, Although it's possible. It's possible now. Really? Yeah. The only, the only person that's ever given birth is Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, I saw a man the other day that gave birth. Really? Well, he wasn't always a man. But they, oh. now that they say, you see, when, when a child is born, like yes. people say, how's your girl? You say, we are going to wait till she tells us, you know, okay. because him or her can then decide whether he or she at some point <laughs> wants to have a baby. It's confusing, but we have to get with the times. It's very, very confusing. Are you loving being 40, though? I do like being 40, yeah. You don't love it, but you like it. Uh, right now, I do like it. I don't know. I, it feels a lot like when I was 39, though. Okay. Pretty much the same. Yeah. Okay. We'll catch up with you at your show there. If you want to see more of Nick and all of his funny, be sure to catch him at the Baxter Theatre from this coming week through until January the 14th next year. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be hilarious. And, men, I'm sure he's going to say a lot of things you wish you could say out loud. Well, we'll see you right back after the break. Nick, you going to hang out a little bit? Apparently I have to. It's in the contract. Yes, sir. We'll be right back. <laughs>